Okay guys, today is, one second, let me actually check that because last time I fucked it up. Today's June 13th, we are about to go on our camping trip right now. It is a Saturday. We have probably about, I don't know, an hour, hour and 30 of travel. And I'm just, you know, getting ready. Got all my shit in my bag, again. And, uh, just thought I would start this vlog here at home, like I've started every other vlog. And please excuse the mess of my room, because it is a fucking shit show. Actually, not really, it's not that bad. It's all right. So whatever. But yeah, just thought I would, uh, Say hello before we we go. <laughs> we go. That's what we're doing. We're going. I'll see you when you get to Johnny's house. <laughs> it's taking a bit longer to get going than I anticipated. Yeah, me too. I agree. I'm not shocked. I'm not sh I'm not shocked. <laughs> we forgot a lot of things. Yeah, we I've did. Discovered. We did not plan that very well. We did forget a lot of things. Because we're, we're still running to get... Why don't we get ice at the convenience store we're currently at? I'm actually going to do that right now. It's a good <laughs> it's idea. That's a really good idea. That's a really good idea. So we got to get some ice. That's the next step here. We stopped at this convenience store right outside of Mission. We're going to walk in here and get some ice. Hi. Um, could I uh, get some ice? Ice? Yeah. Uh, yeah, whatever, what, I guess whatever you got. We just need it for the cooler. I'm just gonna get some ice. This feels weird. I've never really like vlogged in the store like this before. Oh. Have a good weekend. You too. Thank you. Okay, now we got the ice. Next stop, going camping. I think, uh, John, where's the next stop? We're late to the site, but I uh, don't really know how long it's going to take us to get there still. We still have to make a stop in this place called De Roche. They sell fireworks. Uh, we're also going to be stopping at, uh, I think we have to get wood for the fire. I'm not too sure about that one. Fucking too many cars. But yeah, I'll keep you guys updated and uh, I guess I'll see you there. We got so much fun shit, like the amount of stuff we actually packed is crazy. We have like, like uh, I forget what they're called, paddle boards. We have like, I don't know, a bunch of stuff. I'm just super looking forward to this. It's actually gonna be so much fun. Well, everyone, we have now reached our final destination of Grace Lake Campground. One of the most beautiful, actually not really, it's actually quite barren here and just a bunch of hicks. That's pretty much what what's, what's made, this place is made of is hicks. I mean, look, we got one right there in the background, right there. Damn. Damn. Johnny, you've been working out? Huh? You've been working out? We've been uh, just getting everything set up. Ken's included. She's trying to do that fucking bunny ear bullshit. <laughs> yeah, we're just getting everything set up. We have some fun shit we're gonna be doing tonight. Probably gonna be having a few beers, you know. Drink, legal drinking age here in BC is 19 years old, so we're all legal. Don't worry about that. We have our tent there. We're gonna put, hopefully we can put this tarp, this massive tarp right here. I'm hoping we can hang it from a tree over there, but I don't really know yet. So we're gonna have to figure that one out. Sage is probably gonna try and bring her car here, right there, back it in, and then that way we can uh, we can get a uh, you know non-wet space because that's one thing we're worried about this weekend is we're worried it's actually gonna piss rain all weekend. So I don't really know. I'm just excited. I love camping. Camping is so freaking sick. Like the view we have from here is actually pretty sick too. I'll show you guys that. I'll show you it right now. It's actually super nice. I mean, it, you, I don't really think the camera does it justice just because of how layered these mountains are, but 
It's just like rolling hills, but rolling mountains. Can I brighten that up? I don't know. But yeah. I'm just, I'm just happy we're here. I've been looking forward to this trip for quite a while now, even though it's been like two weeks in the planning. It would be, it would be good if we can just get some uh, paddle boarding shots. I really wish I had a GoPro right now because that would actually be pretty sick. But for now, we're just gonna get everything set up and uh, I'll be back later. So, this is where I will be sleeping. Look at this, my pink little blanket. Look at how comfy this is. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. That's the stuff right there. Oh my God, I'll definitely be able to write some poetry here. Oh, that feels nice. This is so comfortable, so good. I keep looking at the side camera, I need to focus on this. It's difficult, I feel like I'm should be looking at myself, but I, in reality, I should be looking at this camera. So, that's what that's looking like for the next few days. We're gonna come back out here, just need to put on my slides. Oh, there we go. Okay, so, this is what we got going over here. We got Johnny Boy, we got Sage, Ken's, Oh, Sage is camera shy. Oh, isn't, isn't that cute? So guys, Sage and I are walking through this trail right now and on our way back, unfortunately I spilled beer all over my camera, so I'm hoping that it stays alive. If it's working right now, I don't see why it won't work later, but I mean technology has a way with liquids that usually says different, so I'm not too sure. Sage, what do you think about the whole matter? Not surprised, just disappointed. Not surprised, just disappointed. Quote unquote, we're gonna keep that. <laughs> that's a quote we're gonna, that's a meme. It's a new meme. Okay. A little muddy. A little muddy. We gotta get that in case she falls. Oh, almost, almost. <laughs> Almost good freaking material right there. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> I got that on camera. I would have loved that. Damn, that's pretty. Damn. Look at this. Beauty. Beauty at its finest. Grace Lake. Sponsor me. Sponsor me. <laughs> <laughs> So tomorrow, I don't really know what we're gonna do. I'm probably gonna stop vlogging for tonight, but until then, probably, actually maybe maybe we might record a little bit of uh, that, that meme game, but I'm not too sure yet. I just hope that tonight ends up becoming a little less wet, because as you guys can hear right now, probably you can probably hear the rain more than my voice. It's really wet, it's a little too wet. So I'm just hoping that it's all right. I hope that everybody enjoys this vlog. That's just the way it's gotta be. So until then, till tomorrow. Okay guys, it's now June 14th, Sunday, June 14th. And unfortunately we're ending the trip early. Um, I honestly don't feel that good. This morning I woke up, like last night before I went to bed and then this morning I kind of started feeling kind of shitty so I decided, well we all decided to kind of just pack up early plus the weather is disgusting right now. It is absolutely dog and I honestly just don't even know what to say. We could, we didn't even really go to the lake. I just, I don't know, it didn't really turn out the way we wanted it to but it was kind of fun. I got some cool shots and uh, I will talk to you guys when I get home. Hey guys. So I just wanted to uh, catch you guys up on why we left. So last night, I kind of started to feel a little anxious. I felt like I kind of just felt like I needed to go home. And I'm thankful that I have the friends that I do and the cousin that I have because I feel like if I was with some other people, that wouldn't have happened. They wouldn't have been so good about going home so early, but yeah, I just feel like if you have any anxiety, it's all right to, to, 
yeah, well, not not just express, but to, to, like, I, I don't want to say that, like, you should be afraid of your anxiety, but at the same time, like, if you really need to get away, it's okay, you know, like, it's fine to do that, and I feel like that's just something that I really needed to do, because I just, I don't know, I just can't even explain it. It's just one of those things. I mean, if you've had it before, I mean, you know what I mean. And you know how it feels to be in that position where you feel like you're trapped. And that's kind of how I felt. So, just thought I should let you know. Hey guys, please excuse the hair. It's pretty late right now. It's like almost 3 a.m. I just wanted to say one thing before I, because before I, I'm editing this video right now and I'm getting pretty close to being done. I know, like, I was a little hesitant to uh, make it this video. I was a little hesitant to edit it. And the reason is, is because, it's not because it was, well, it wasn't a bad video. I honestly just felt super, super, I don't know. It's just a very weird time for me. I don't know what triggered my anxiety. But the whole point of this channel is for people to become more comfortable with talking about it. So just having one of those experiences, I think it just makes it all that much more real. And I was a little hesitant to upload this, but I really just think that it's important for me to get my message across of why I want to make this channel. And I think this is a perfect example of how it is acceptable to have these moments and to, to be anxious. I just feel like more people need to talk about it. And I'm just so grateful of the people I was with at the time because I genuinely just, I honestly just could not handle that moment. And like even when I was working yesterday, I still felt ill from that day. I know that it sounds a little weird, but I just felt so anxious and I just felt sick. I don't know, I don't know. I know we all have our things that trigger it. I'm not too sure what triggered it for me, but I'm just, I just think that it's not, like it would be a good thing for me to share this experience with you guys even though it wasn't one of the best experiences of my life. I mean things happen, I don't know, it's just, I know it's difficult to get across but I hope that this video kind of shows that it's okay to have these moments and I know we all get them. It's just important that we understand and that we, have, we surround ourselves with the people that truly actually give a shit about how you feel in the moment because I mean, I cut a whole day off for a trip, and I just feel, I feel bad about that. I feel kind of embarrassed, but at the same time, like, I just couldn't do it. And I'm just so grateful that I had those people by my side to really be there for me in that time that I kind of needed it. And I just think that it's important that we kind of get this message across throughout this community that it's okay to have those moments. And although maybe I was struggling with it for the last few days, you get over it, and you live your life, and not really anything that you can do about it. Maybe try and figure out what your triggers are for your anxiety. I mean, I'm not no counselor, but I know that that is definitely a reason why you can get anxiety. And so I think that it's important to like figure out what your triggers are and just understand that and try and fight it. But at the same time, don't put yourself in a situation where you feel like you're not going to be able to get out of her. You know what I mean. I just want to say thank you for watching. And I will be uploading a new video pretty soon. I'm going golfing tomorrow around 11.30. So I'll probably be filming that. Thank you so much. And also, I also wanted to say, uh, comment some things that you guys want me to, s some things you guys want to see because I'll, I'll do a lot of things. Like I'm just excited to get this channel going. I'm surprised how many views I've already gotten. I mean, it, I don't really think it happens that quickly, but it, it's it been pretty good for me. I mean, I'm just happy that people are watching the videos. So thank you. I will uh, see you in the next one and uh, good night. Well, I guess good night for me. I don't know what time you're watching this, so peace out.